Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to Valhelsia 3 with your buddy Super Turtle here. Look, I'm Buzz Lightyear still. Pretty neat, huh? Anyway, last episode we went ahead and got this armor, and uh, I ate a pickle today. Just uh, thought I should let you know. Um, it was tasty. Yeah, anyway, so let's go ahead and go over here because we have some things to do. Now, there is a, uh, a block, I guess a machine in this game, that allows us to create cobblestone, stone... Uh, sand, glass, I even believe silicone as well, maybe that's in a different mod. But uh, yes, the material stonework factory is a very overpowered tool that we are going to be trying to use today. So we need to go ahead and get this plastic going. Um, not the plastic, but the machine. I am a machine, I never sleep. Tomatoes are in my brain. Uh, do we have the brick? <sighs> you know, I'm starting to get really annoyed with not having a way, to, like having to go all the way down here to do this. It's getting on my nerves. That was my nose, by the way. Don't don't worry about it. I'm fine. Uh, I'm fine. Don't trust me. Uh, don't trust me. I'm fine. Um, oh, look. Okay. You. Okay, so these are actually really expensive. Um, we're going to make 12 of these. Yeah. We're going to make 12. Why 12, you ask? Because I don't want 11. That's literally the only answer I have. Okay, let's go ahead and get this processing over here. Um, I almost wonder if it wouldn't be a bad idea to tap into this. Hello? Hello? Are you there, Mr. Enderman? Do you want to tickle me? Please don't. Okay, so we need to... Mechanism... Um, we need some fluids. Are you fluid? You are fluid. Perfect. Hey, look, I'm out of steel. Oh, no. Oh, I don't know. I put that back. <sighs> Sorry if I keep you on and it's kind of late. Okay, so pipe. Yeah, that's what I want. That's how we roll. We roll like this. Okay, stepping on the beat, do 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 do. Okay, so I think we should go ahead and boop these together. Right, 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 right. Yes. I really hope I have enough to get over here. I do have 8,000 in here though, so it's not something to scoff at. Um, Freaking heck. Oh, oh no, what have I done? Hey, look at all that fuel. Okay, so now we can go ahead and actually get these going. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. I have to put each of these in. Okay, I forgot about this. So I'm gonna be here for a minute. I'll talk to you guys in a second. All right, so the 12 of these have been made. I also went ahead and processed all of our netherite scraps up here. If we threw our ancient debris in here that our nether quarry is getting, we throw it in the enrichment chamber. We do get one here. Now, if we put it in the, um, let me see, there should be a way, I thought, to get more than one. Wait, okay, hold up. Recipe uses, if we go to the crusher, you get three. 
And then if you take this and put it in the enrichment chamber, you get one per. Okay, so that's by far the best way to do it. I'll probably do that going forward. Uh, we might set up an automated way to go ahead and do that. Uh, but now since the simple machine frame is done, uh, we have the advanced machine frame that we need to go ahead and worry about. Uh, so this requires gold. All right. We do have enough to go ahead and continue to make it, but we don't need more iron. Um, if we go like this, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then we need some gold. Yep, that should be all that we need. We can go ahead and put those in there. All right. So I'll make the first couple with you guys on camera here. So boom, 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 boom. Oh, this requires pink slime. Oh, so we're going to need to make another one of these guys, a, a solution chamber. That's okay. That's that's actually okay. Um, so that brings me to what we were going to do now is the mob slaughter factory. Uh, we should have everything except everything. Wait a second. Yes, go ahead and put that there. Two swords. And two axes. Okay. Like this mob slaughter factory, we're going to need some power, so we're going to need a another this guy here quantum all right what are we missing perfect okay we got another one of these guys go ahead and sleep oh bikabi so the farm has been running for quite a while here if we grab our levels beautiful um so actually, yes, I want to break it from the back. Do do do. Okay, so this should be working technically. Then we go like this. Set it to power, energy. Output on all sides. Hello. Yes. Okay. So we should be able... Pink slime. Yep, we are getting the pink slime. Very good, very good. Okay, so I got two tanks here. So we should be able to put one here. Um, yes. And then we're going to have the meat... Um, yeah, okay, so it's being pushed out the bottom there, and then if we go like this, actually, let's just make sure, okay, so the only way, the thing that can come out here, oops, this needs to be in fluids mode. Yes, pink slime, perfect. All right, so our pink slime is coming here. We can go ahead and put on a range upgrade to just make it too wide. Uh, we will probably go ahead and put a speed upgrade in there. I'll go ahead and make both of the upgrades. And then we will we'll be good to go. So, uh, immersive engineering and industrial foregoing, yes. So plus one, this is what we're making. We need two redstone. We got the quartz, or the cobble. Now all we need is the glass. Perfect. Let me know down in the comments, guys, if there's a way to auto automate the dissolution chamber. If you know how, or if you know a way, just be like, yeah, do that. Uh, if you don't, just be like, uh, punch the can punch a can in the face. Okay. All right. Actually, all these go here. Sugar there. Perfect. Okay, this will get crafted up. Booms. One speed upgrade done.
And second speed upgrade done. Cool. Okay, so speed upgrade number one. Can we do number two? We can't. Dang it. Ah, okay, let's just go ahead and put the range upgrade in here then too. So yeah, uh, now all I need to do is just kind of chill here and wait for the pink slime to fill up. And we can go ahead and start moving that back and forth. Very cool. Okay, so I did put a little bit of the pink slime in. Oh, it actually made one. Whoops, I didn't want to do that. But uh, yeah, so I went ahead and had one ready to go in here and didn't think that it would go so quick. Uh, but yeah, we have just a few here so I can go ahead and get some of these crafting while this is still kind of filling up. I just like kind of swapped it out. Um, but something I want to talk to you guys about real quick. I think we're kind of starting to outgrow this base here and was thinking about maybe starting a final base. Uh, I've got some pretty good ideas about what I want to do, uh, but I, I do want to see your guys' suggestions. So in the description, there is a, a Discord uh, link to mine, and you can accept the, the rules there and go ahead and get access to all the channels. And there's a channel called Suggestions that if you guys want, I want you to go ahead and post some base ideas. Uh, this is the the block palette that I'm going to be going for. And I also discovered something else that really, really caught my eye for a block. Um, these slag bricks, I think, look really, really cool. And I want to, I'm pretty sure I want to find a way to implement these. Uh, so, yeah, so these are going to be, this is the, the block palette that we're working with here. Um, this is going to be the floor, obviously. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the block palette we're working with. And I want you guys to just go ahead and maybe see if you can make something look that looks really cool. And I might take some inspiration from it. And if I do take inspiration from, inspiration from it, I will shout you out in the next video. So yeah, there's your task for this episode, peeps. Make sure you go do it down below. But anywho, uh, we need we do have the ability to make two of these. We're gonna make uh, three more. Okay, so we got a total of six of these guys. Now I wanna go ahead and start making some of these material stonework factories. Uh, so we need the pink slime to go ahead and combine with some glass panes. That's why we didn't use all of them. And I really, really, really wish there was a way to automate this because this is just, it's just really annoying, honestly. Okay, so now that we got six of these made up, we can go ahead and start crafting up the uh, material stonework factories. I can show you guys why I love these so much. Okay, the gold gears, ferni, good to go. Crafting table, good to go. Okay, we should be able to make all six of these. What was that at the bottom? Oh, slime balls. Okay, yep, so we did go ahead and make six. That should be all we need for now. I did make some extras that we really didn't need. Um, but let's go ahead and plug these into power. We're going to grab some storage drawers here. Okay, and I don't think we're actually going to use all six of these, so nothing to worry about. Uh, but we are going to make six upgrades. Perfect. Okay, so I think a good spot actually will probably be just like right here. Um, so we're going to turn off the vein mining. Okay, we're going to put these material stonework factories right here. And then we are going to put the drawers above them. Okay, then we'll upgrade these bad boys here. I think I put two into one. Okay, so this is generating cobblestone. Oh, we need to pump lava and water into these. Okay, these have changed. 
Okay, because it used to just be you didn't need anything. You just pump it in. So do we have a, like a, a lava generator thing we can make? No. Uh. Hmm. I don't know how many more of these are going to be able to make. Yeah, see, then we're out. We're out of these guys. Dang. Ah. This is rather annoying. They changed how material stoneworking factories work. I'm not a big fan. We don't have ender IO, so we can't pump like two different fluids into one thing. To one block. Lava, water. So annoying. Okay, so we can go ahead, get a sink set up. Um. Okay. Let's go ahead and get some steel made. Okay, we got a stack of steel dust. Let's go ahead and get it processing. Okay, so we have all the these guys, I guess, that we need. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and block off some of that water. The pumps are for the nether, obviously. In case you guys didn't know, we did move the garden cloches away. Okay, so we might actually have to inset these back by one block. Um, so we can put some half slabs here. Uh, I don't know if that actually works. Um, hmm. Okay, so we're probably only going to have three of these guys then. And then... Yeah, we can move these directly below. We're just going to make the best of what we have, guys. Unfortunately, it looks like we're only going to have to have three with the setup we have. If we do make the new base, we can expand this out to what we actually need. This is going to be what it looks like for now. Okay. And so we can run power through the sides, which is good. So items go up top, power comes from the sides, and then the bottom and back will be for the lava generations. Okay, so it sounds like we got a plan going, which is very cool. All right, now that we got 28 more of these atomic alloys, we can come over here and make up the quantum, uh, quantum this guy. And this will be, we'll have a fluid one, so we'll need one. Over here, we can run power from it and lava. If we go here. Okay.
Okay, so if we turn this on, boom. Okay, so these all should have... Oh, yeah. There we go. Need to set that to eject. Okay, so now these have power. Uh, let's go ahead and get them some water. Uh, we can do this by doing this. Okay, and then if we click this twice. Okay, so that has been taken care of. Now we can do lava. And I think the, ooh. Yes. Uh. Shoot, this isn't actually where I wanted it. Okay, and then our second one. Um, um, okay, so we're moving, we're moving power. Okay, so lava and power need to come from here. Actually, we'll probably just run it out in front this like so okay so then all we need to do is pump lava into here and it will go this these so there should be water in here yes but we can do lava which is cool Output on the bottom there. <sighs> okay, how are these looking? These have got water, very cool. Let's go set up the lava collector. Okay, so we're here in the nether. I don't, well, there are some lava monsters over there, so we need to be a little careful. But um, let's have a look here. So I want to see if these are going to be our best bet. Uh, okay, so definitely not that way. Oh, they're closing in. Look at that. Juke. Got him. How is that possible? He shot me after he died. Wow, that guy went flying.
Uh, I'm not gonna lie, these guys are really annoying. Okay, he did. Oh, I'm on lava. I'm in fire. I'm on fire. Okay. I know there's another guy down there. We'll see if he comes over. How are you already back? Let's just set this up. Oh my gosh, I did it again. Oh my gosh, I messed that up. Ow, now I'm on fire. How well does this dude hit something? Not that well. Okay. So if we supply this with power. Okay, so these have power, no fluid. I believe we have to give this somewhere to go for it to work properly. Alright, these might require a lever. Okay, so... Well, it seems to actually be working. Um... Went ahead and just placed lava underneath it, and it seems to... Oh, lag. Seems to be working. Don't know how far out it goes. Okay, energy, speed. Speed, uh, energy. And then energy... Speed. So we should start to see this start to go pretty quick. And I don't know the range that we have on it. Doesn't seem to be very big. Okay. Maybe it's because it's full. Fluids back. Is it really because we have water in there? Because these say they're full of lava. Um, fluids, back is input. Yeah, I think it's because we have, nope, there's no, it's here. I do need to come back and set it up, get an anchor upgrade here. But other than that, it should be okay. Um, we don't have a trash can. Uh, how do we get it out of there? This is actually the perfect amount for the water to go into. Should completely drain it. So if I go like this, fluids output. Um... We get the freaking water out of there. Oh, there's lava in there. So all I need to do now is break this. Yeah, there's lava. Okay, 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 okay. Um, so we go here to fluids, output out the bottom, and then if we set this, yes. Oh, 
Yes, it's working. Okay, so we need to go ahead and make sure that is chunk loaded over there. Give me a moment here. Okay, we do need to smash up a diamond for this. Okay, we got the anchor there. Let's go ahead and go to the nether after we sleep. Okay, so this is still going, which is a good sign to see. Okay, so let's go ahead here. Chunk loaded. We definitely need to find a better spot to put this eventually when it does run out. But it, oh wow, we're getting all the way over there. Okay, so we do have a decent amount of lava here. Lava is backed up. Freaking heck. Okay, the anchor is there. Let's go ahead and just head home. Perfect. Okay, so lava production has been set up for these guys, which I'm super excited about. As you can see, this is all filled with lava. And we are making stone. Okay, so that makes gravel. And if we were to do that again, that makes sand, perfect. Okay, so this is gonna be our sand dough. What happens if we do this? Does it push it out the top? That would make everything so much easier if I just pushed it out the top, man. <sighs> okay. We got glass here. We got sand here. And then I actually think we're just going to have cobblestone here. Uh, it's going to need a pipe. This thing is fighting me the entire way. Good thing is, is none of these should really have an issue. Let's go ahead and get some items. Uh, here we go. Sand, blank, and where did my cobblestone one go? Um, yeah, we're going to be fixing these. Whoops. Oh. Okay, perfect. Um, these aren't pulling out. I'm starting to become very annoyed with industrial foregoing in this pack. Um, so if we go here. I don't honestly know what we're supposed to do with this. Okay, this kind of looks like a dud because, yeah, yeah, let's see here. Um, 
Item. What do we get here? We got item pipe. That doesn't really work. Um, Yeah, there's really nothing else other than what this is supposed to be working. Like it doesn't have. That's so annoying. Okay, guys, so the material stonework factories technically work. We might just have to put an external storage or something. We might have to just pump these into our system and then put them into our drawers here, but we will do that in a later episode. But, guys, that's been Industrial 4 going. It's a piece of crap mod in 1.16 as of right now, and I freaking hate it, so I wouldn't recommend using it at all costs. Uh, but anyways, guys, hope you all have a fantastic day. I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.